how I stopped a human trafficking operation. I live in Croatia, and these things are not often at all. A bit of a backstory, I live in the capital city, but nearby I have a town that is mostly my second home. My parents split up when I was a kid, and my dad lives in that town. We lived there before they broke apart, and I have all of my dearest friends there. Near that town there is a village where my girlfriend lives, and she is a normal high school girl with basic grades and more love for me that I can't comprehend. This happened two weeks ago, and she told me that in that town there is a black van with German plates roaming around and seemingly taking kids. I have always been protective of her, and I can't bear having the guilt of anything happening to her. One night she told me that her parents weren't home, and she needs to home alone at night. From what I have heard from all of those stories, I couldn't let her go by herself. I always carry multiple pocket knives that I took from my grandpa for self-defense. The night I was walking her home, I noticed a van. It was heading for us, stopped in front of us, and two men dressed in black rushed out and came running for us. I have trained boxing for a few years, so I know the basics. The men came charging for us, and I knocked out the first guy while I told my girlfriend to run to her home, as we were quite close to her home by now. She got home while I fought off to the two men. Once I knocked the first one, the second ran to the van and drove off, leaving the other guy with me alone. I interrogated him, and he wasn't willing to give me any info, so I just left him there. When I got to her home, her father asked me what happened. Her father is a war veteran, having been serving in the military during the war. So he was a pretty big badass. Me and him went out to get his buddies and finish this thing once and for all. He had a gang full of muscular guys that were war vets, so some of them carried pistols that were still used during the war. We found the van parked in a driveway and busted this other dude's home. It was a big house and it was pretty old. Mainly made from brick without any facade. Once we entered, we found him with two children that were missing in the area. Using what we had, we interrogated him, and he told us he is, in fact, a child predator. We gave him over to the police, and they placed him in a cell for the night until he got sent to jail. At the end, we got a beer and had a laugh about that whole situation. 